everybody! Welcome back to Let's Build with the Hellcat. As you can see, I am standing in the middle of my town square, and I am sh about to sh talk to you about what our project is. I am also re-announcing once more, outside of the podcast, that the Northwestern Town Square is officially called Shady Heights. And I am going to be basing all of my Let's Builds on Building Shady Heights. Today we are making another addition, and I might go and see if my friend Briar, who can finally play, wants me to build a couple of buildings I have done here, so you can see me build those. Alright, so let's flip over to the title screen. Let's build with the Hellcat! And I am happy to announce that we are going off of a blueprint to build a bakery! Yes siree, let's get started. All right, so I've already started. I made the platform so I knew I had all the stone I needed. Oh, by the way, look, TT, I found Boop. And I pinned him up for his own safety because he kept playing on my um, platform. Anyway, we're right across from the library, just up the road from the stockyards and right next to the mine build, mining building. So we're going to go over here next to where this sign is, which is where the door is going to go. And we're going to grab our dark oak and we'll move some stuff out of the way, make some planks, and there we go. We're going to keep our axe on hand for in case of, you know, mishaps. So let's just get this started here, hop up here, there we go, and we'll just walk around and get this done. Uh, you will see me glancing randomly at the blueprints to make sure I am not missing anything. I might do a follow-up to the bakery and do an expansion at some point to give it like a little garden area for outside eating so to speak. <laughs> or I might even give it a chimney. The tricky part is going to be make it, making it so the working fireplace I love doing working fireplaces places, just so you know will not burn down the entire house that is always a problem I keep running into it on my own world so I'm going to make sure that I can't do it by the way if I get a little bit jumpy Asian Luke, cool Lucas and I were all recording at the same time so there might be a little bit of lag just for, for your guys' information so, we've got the first layer of wood done. Let's see, I think we need, as I make it so I can flip over to my blueprint. Okay, now we need a fence and some stairs. Now, instead of making it out of the same material I'm making my walls, like it has there, I'm actually going to make it out of birch, so it's a nice complementary color. Now, right now we're making the counter, and I think I messed up can't remember but let's get rid of this extra block here um, put that there make a crafting table crap I made too many <laughs> um, we'll just set one down and we can toss the rest in the chest um, need some sticks because I forgot to bring some birch oh wait I brought one birch fence but I still need to make birch stairs <sighs> c'est la vie Okay, so we'll just pop this in and make some stairs. Do, 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 do. I have no idea why I'm making that sound. <laughs> anyway. <clears throat> now, the reason why I decided to make the bakery is, well... I am wanting to build a little town. I want it to look nice. I want it to be homey. I want people to want to come up and live. And let's see. Oh, I did mess up in that corner, didn't I? Anyway, so I'm thinking the bakery would it'd be like this little centerpiece. I mean, I can expand it later and make it so there's maybe two rooms, make it a little longer. But I am going right now exactly as the blueprints show. So that's why you will see me flashing back and forth to the blueprints. I mean, the only way I'm doing it different from the blueprints is instead of using cobblestone, I'm using still bricks. And instead of oak wood, I'm using both birch and dark oak. Excuse me. And 
and I'm all, instead of using torches for lighting it up, I'm actually planning on using some glowstone. But I think I forgot to bring it, so when we get to that point, I'll probably pause the video and teleport back to the house to grab some... Oh, excuse me. Um, get rid of these two. Now, right here, we're putting a chest, which will be where the extra baked goods would go. So, like, cakes and cookies and stuff. So we'll just pause here and we'll put it in fast forward until we get to where we need the glows. Need to add. And I'm back to, talk to talking to you. So right now we're going to add the furnaces, which I'm going to mention since I talked about maybe putting a chimney and fireplace on. When I probably put that on, I will actually make it, like I said, a working fireplace, which means I will put the furnaces in the back of the fireplace and have flames going on in front of it on another rack, which will then make it seem like I'm actually using the fire to cook which I always thought was cool when I actually found out you could do something like that. So I like using it when I'm doing builds like this. So we're checking out what we need next, and I have a bunch of cakes at home that I'll add in later. <clears throat> so we're going to hop down and grab our next items, which will be we need to put in our glass panes, so we'll grab the glass panes. Again, we're following the instructions, so... Oh. Oh, excuse me. Oh, it's getting dark. Oh well. I have this place pretty lit up that mom shouldn't come and bother me except for maybe the occasional creeper. But other than the creepers, I should be okay. And of course, the skeleton deciding to be a total jerk and shooting me off of my build. That always sucks. Anyway. So we'll put up our cakes, make it all nice, and then we'll add the third layer, which includes actually putting a roof over the door. <laughs> so here we go, and I think I'll just fast forward to the next part.
Okay, now as you can see, we're finishing up the roof. Just adding this last little piece, and then we're gonna do this. And we'll hop down, and we'll just scoot over, do this, do that last piece, and then bloop! And close it off. Get the trusty old axe, and we'll just get rid of these. Now we got perfect spot for our glowstone, which we will hop home and go get. So, oh look at the leg. <laughs> I'm going to probably end up in my basement and then bounce back up into the main room. Oh, I hate it when it does this. Oh, whoa, I'm in the deep basement. <laughs> I'm actually working on maybe making like either a um, potions room or a um, just random room down there. I was actually going to um, have a pet, a bat that I got a um, spawn egg from the costume party in there. However, I tried to get him in his cage slash um, environment. Yeah, he escaped and I couldn't get him back in, so I had to kill him. So I might have to get a new spawn egg for a bat. Which sucks. And I'm in a cave. Why am I in a cave? How did I get here? I was teleporting back into my bill. I don't know where I am. Okay. 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 I see sand. That means I'm close to the river. Okay. So we'll just take our way out. out. Come on. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. I'm feeling slightly. Ooh. Light. Thank you, Lord. Okay, oh wait, uh, what? Uh, okay, I'm suddenly super lagging. I probably should not have teleported home. Oh well, let's just get the glowstone in, which will brighten this place right up. Oh yes, that is perfect! And that was really loud <laughs> and sharp. Anyway, so we are almost done. Um, all we need is a door, so you wanna know what? We are going to put down this. And then we're also going to put some um, stone stairs on the roof. To make it so the rain can't get through. We might put some slabs on too. But right now, let's get our door, which we are doing a birch door. Yes, I love doing contrasts. It's like my favorite thing with Minecraft. You can easily do contrast and it looks so pretty. Okay, so come on, open up. <sighs> Excuse me again. Okay, got some stone stairs. Okay, we gotta get rid of the door, the sign here and the door. Coming soon, Shetty Heights Bakery. I put that up just in case I wasn't able to get straight to it, or I, if I had to um, do this in a couple of days. But I think I can do this all in one sitting. So, we'll just pop that on there. Oh, that looks so nice. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it! Make some of these. Boom. Oh, poor Asian. Well, I'm almost almost. I'm almost done. <laughs> and what I did was I skipped it. Actually, I accidentally paused. That's what happened. And um, because I haven't really messed with my bandy cam so I think my um, pause button is my backspace so I ended up pausing it and yeah but anyway we built a ladder on the side of the building so we can do this and please wait sorry about that phone rang anyway um so ah, I keep messing up so we've already done the bottom half so now we're working on this the top part of the stairs and we're leaving a gap I'm going to make some slabs and we'll put the slabs in between the top stairs and the bottom stairs and I just placed down an extra stair and it's upside down <sighs> 
I think the leg is finally starting to affect me. Anyway. Um, so yeah. We're almost done. We're having fun. Everything's going good. We're almost done with this. And then when we're done with this, we'll add in the cakes and all that jazzy stuff. So you want to know something? I'm going to fast forward. Yeah, that's a good idea. Then if the phone rings, you guys don't have to hear it. Okay, now that the major building is done, let's free Boop and let him run around. There you go, Boop! You're free! TT will be happy, you're free, and running around up here. So are your brethren somewhere. <sighs> My pet Boop. I know, he's the town's mascot. If I catch him again, I'll give him a nice big pen and he can just run around and he'll be free as a lark. Well, a bunny. And then he'll be protected from evil things and he'll be safe and warm and happy. I can even make him a cute little den or a house or something. I am really rambling now. <laughs> and this isn't even my podcast. Anyway, Boop can go in and check out everything. Let's see. Oh yeah, I need to make a path. Actually, I can make two paths. So we're gonna do a path from over here. And I'll just pause and we'll fast forward through this.
and that concludes the let's build for the bakery and thank you everyone so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this let's build there should be a new podcast coming up shortly probably will be next week sometime once i get some questions or i'll just ramble about nothing <laughs> or i'll maybe i'll read something that i've written or something i'll figure it out don't worry um today you notice we have background music it is the smile song from my little pony sung by pinkie pie and i got got it off of youtube um the instrumental it was created by mando pony awesome person on youtube i have a couple of his songs um and i just did a little bit of remixing in my audio thingy <laughs> i'm so technical and then you know just made it longer and put it on continuous loop in movie maker and voila we got background music thanks everyone for watching and check out my previous videos and my podcast and if you think i should build something sp particular up here in the in shady heights tell me and i'll see if i can find the right blueprints or if i can figure out something that i like thanks everyone for watching be stay creative and later